All right, welcome back. So, got that bracket installed, yay. So that's good. And then uh, you can see my N6 uh, transmission cooling there and there. Now I'm still a little off on the routing, but I'm working on it. So these go up over through the gap. These are the oil cooling lines. I'm going to adjust those here shortly, but they're pretty good. Now they're really nice and solid. So, I mean, obviously they've got a little bit of slack, but uh, no uh, vibration spots that I can tell. So anyway, back in a bit. All right, welcome back. And we've got some anti-chafe. Uh, split rubber hose there and then these come up got a splitter there everything's just kind of zip tied in any place where it might rub so you know cable uh, for the hood release where it touches I just zip tied it um, obviously there's space now the brackets where it's supposed to be but uh, this isn't the best job but Hopefully it will work and not chafe around. Still concerned about the um, the oil cooling lines and their placement, and I don't think I have it quite right yet. So I'll go back underneath and show you what I'm talking about. Back in a minute here. All right, there's the oil cooling lines, and they actually seem to run vertical straight up once they make the bend so I think that is I think that's right but I don't know I mean they're they're parallel to the um, to the shift lever or the shift rod shift actuator and there's plenty of clearance so I think I'm happy with that uh, they're not hitting the firewall there's a gap there so you know, if I, if I tilt them forward, um, they're going to be, like, on the manifold. So, I'm just not sure. Anyway, uh, cooling lines, though, for the transmission cooler, come over here. So, over the frame rail, under the cab, back over the transmission. Sorry, it's really hard to film under here. Anyway, so hopefully uh, I'll get some anti-chafe on that and zip tie everything up but that's the routing so up tucked in out of the way I'm not gonna catch it on anything so pretty happy with that um, like I said got a zip tie and anti-chafe a couple spots but uh, otherwise I think I'm good to go no leaks Woo! alrighty folks awesome